Every organization would like their API program to be successful. In this video, we will talk about adoption strategies to engage developers. Having adoption strategies is about finding ways to grow your API program, and building a successful API program starts by creating a vibrant community around it. But first, let's take a look at who is in your community. We often hear from companies that believe a developer community is restricted to only internal developers. However, there are many types of developers that make up a developer community. Customers often have trusted partners whose developers will create innovative applications. External developers can also play a role in innovating. Successful communities include all types of developers and also engages with customers, API teams, and stakeholders. Once you understand who is a part of your community, there are five questions organizations must consider. What is the channel or medium by which you will support your developer community? Is there a developer portal available? What is your developer onboarding process? Does the time for onboarding slow down the time for application development? How quickly can your developers obtain an API key to get started? How will developers get answers to questions? And finally, how will you measure the success of your program? Answering these questions will help you formulate the strategies needed to increase adoption of your API program. Let's dive into these questions by looking at the five E's of adoption. First, you must excite and educate everyone. Information should generate awareness and promote your API program. Using a developer portal can substantially increase trust and bring credibility to your APIs by treating both your internal and external developers equally. A few ways you can increase adoption to your developer portal is through sponsoring events, writing blog posts, sharing freemium mock data so developers can try out your API products on the spot, and highlighting your ecosystem and partnerships. Build a community that continuously informs and empowers your developers to get involved. The developer onboarding process should be quick and easily understandable, leading developers to exactly what they need to get started. The experience should also be the same for everyone in your developer community. You empower developers by supplying them with what they need. For example, hosting a dev jam or hackathon helps your developers get into your API program and easily access your APIs. Developing incentive programs for partners to get involved and tutorials showing how easy your developer portal is to use can greatly encourage developers to participate. And trusting collaborators is about offering a self-service developer experience that provides teams with an effortless way to manage their applications throughout their software development lifecycle. One of the key performance indicators your program should track is the time it takes a developer to reach their first API response or a time to first hello world. The faster a developer can register for an API key and get an API response, the more empowered they will feel. You can help developers by collaborating with them on their projects, generating API walkthroughs, inviting developers to events like hackathons, and generating excitement with dev jams. One of the most important strategies is around engagement with your community. A vibrant community means you must continuously support and be involved with the community. A thriving developer community will help grow your program and support teams that encounter issues along the way. A developer evangelist can engage your community answer questions, and connect with partners to expand your digital ecosystem. This becomes easier with self-service forums, ongoing webinar series, or inviting your community in to demo their application to your organization. A successful API program is ultimately measured by how quickly developers enjoy using your APIs. Creating a community where companies, partners, developers, and even customers find value from each other will have a substantial impact on your program success. Developing a thriving community is only the first step. By enabling your partners and developers to assist with building your community, expanding your digital ecosystem, and promoting your API program on your behalf, your organization will unlock the full benefits of these adoption strategies. Now celebrate with your success. Show appreciation to your developers, have a pizza party, and invite your partners to share their testimonials about your API program. How can the five E's of adoption be tracked? An engagement funnel like this can help bring an understanding of what is working and where your program may need more attention. The funnel demonstrates where visitors to your developer portal may drop off in their journey. Let's take a few examples of how this funnel can work in an onboarding process. 
As anonymous developers arrive at your site, we can determine how well you excite them based on the number of anonymous developers that become registered developers. If developers are not registering to use your APIs, it's possible that your onboarding process is too confusing or you have not supplied enough detail about your APIs to get them excited about using them. Supplying mock data, writing blog posts, or simplifying the registration process can greatly improve your program. Let's look at another example. Earlier, we discussed the need to track the time it takes a developer to reach their first API response. Not only should there be metrics around the actual duration, you should also track how many registered developers request an API key and use it to access your APIs. If developers are not feeling empowered or entrusted with your APIs, you may want to improve the self-service aspect of your program or run an event to get your developers more involved. This funnel can help identify gaps in your community that are preventing your API program from being successful. Pay close attention to those metrics at each stage and build KPIs around each step. Your adoption strategy should target each stage and help you meet the goals you identified for your KPIs. Let's reflect back on the five questions we addressed earlier and how the five E's of adoption helps to answer those questions. Here are a few tips to help you build a vibrant community for your API program. Excite and educate developers about your API program. Set up a dev portal to help. Develop for everyone, internal, external, and partners, with an outside-in view. All developers should be treated the same way. Demonstrate your program and consume your own APIs. Show your external developers how you use your APIs internally. Empower your developers to build new experiences quickly. How fast can you get your developers to a successful API call? And trust developers with easy access and self-service tools. Make everything as easy and self-service as possible. Engage the community to support their needs. Be available, be ready, and participate in the success of your developers. Cultivate an API ecosystem by enabling your most passionate partners and continue to seek new relationships and partnerships to grow your program. Know your KPIs to continuously grow your community and continue to iterate on your adoption strategies. Hopefully, you have found a few strategies to help build a vibrant community that increases adoption and grows your API program. Thanks for watching.